We recorded so many videos in the same day. Woohoo! Hi, hello, how's it going? I was tagged by the beautiful, amazing, gorgeous, stunning Elise from the Petite Punk to do the small booktuber tag. As you might know, I am a booktuber and I'm also very small. Literally, I'm five foot four. But I also have a very small channel. So I would like to thank Elise so much for thinking about me and tagging me. It means the whole world to me that I'm actually able to connect with the community and that I'm actually able to make friends in this space. It's just everything that I've ever wanted out of a booktube channel. Shockingly enough, this is going to be another short video. I'm getting the hang of this, guys. I'm getting the hang of this and I'm gonna answer the questions on the tag. We have uh, seven, so yeah, short video. The first question is introduce yourself. Okay, so my name is Luisa, but you can call me Lo. I'm 24 years old and I am Brazilian. I am a human rights attorney and I also work with constitutional law. I am a pole dancer. I have been pole dancing for the past four years. I also go to grad school. Yes, I go to grad school while working full time. Yes, it's miserable and yes, I do not recommend it. But in my master's, I actually focus in feminist critical legal theory and I also focus on philosophy of law. I have a dog. He's an eight-year-old Yorkie. He's called Theodore. Yeah, that is me. Hi, next question. How long have you been on booktube? When this video goes up, I will have been on booktube for two months. Wild, wild. It feels like so little time, but I am loving it so much. Like, it's honestly the best part of my week. Just kind of sit down, film, edit, watch other people's videos, talk to people on Twitter. I'm just having so much fun doing this. When quarantine started, my therapist said that, you know, we have a balance in our life and we have a balance of responsibilities, but we also have a balance of fun and love and things that we love doing. And actually what happened is that before quarantine and before COVID, I actually had managed to strike a pretty good balance between the two because I was going out a lot with my friends and you know, I was doing a whole lot of things. But when COVID struck, it was like my balance just went like this and I had nothing to kind of weight this part down because I have a lot of responsibilities in my day-to-day -day life. And I feel like booktube was exactly what I needed to you know, bring a lot more balance to my life and bring a lot more fun and lightness and just, yeah, I'm gonna get emotional here. Anyhow, this was a really short question and I just made it into a whole essay and you know, anyways. Question number three, what types of videos do you make? I mostly like making wrap-ups and book reviews. I have one book haul on my channel. It wasn't an experience that I really liked. I don't know, I just want to discuss what I read because when I read, I just like, I need to talk about it with someone and I feel like that's what I'm more interested in making. And I feel like when you do book hauls, it's not necessarily talking about the books that you have read and actually discussing the books that you've read but more just talking about the books that you will read eventually and i don't even do tbrs for that exact reason because first things first i'm a huge mood reader but i'm also like i want to know what you thought about the book you know i i I want to know what you thought about it. I want to discuss it. I want to talk about it. So yeah, I'm not really interested in making those short types of videos, but maybe things will change. I don't know. Nothing is set in stone. Question number four. What do you love about book two? Oh, I love how supportive and how fun and how friendly the community is. Of course, there was a lot of drama. Um, the other day I got cancelled for saying that I don't like Ecotar on Twitter, so that one was funny. As a whole, I've met so many amazing people, both here and on book Twitter, and I'm just so grateful to be able to connect with so many people all over the world, which is something that I'm so passionate about and I love doing, interacting with people of other cultures, and just being able to connect with people on a human level and talking about things that are meant to connect with people on a deeper level that are books. Books are meant to do that. So I absolutely love to have this space where I can rant. One thing that I'm not sure if this is something that is widespread in the community, but for me it is. I feel like I don't need to pretend to be anyone else in front of this camera because it's just me, the camera, and the ring light in this room. I feel like I put up so many personas in my day-to-day -day life like at work and in my family and in college and just like I feel like I finally found a space where I can truly be myself and just do the things that I want 
and just do the things that I want when I want and how I want and my therapist is really happy with it <laughs> my therapist is super happy with it um, and I'm super happy too. Question number five. What types of books do you read? Like I said, I will read pretty much anything. I'll usually be reading some nonfiction academic work, but I'll also read like fantasy and I'll also read like trashy erotica. Honest to God, like I have no limits on what I will read and I will not read. Like I said, I'm a huge mood reader and right now I am in the mood for fantasy and etc. But if a book seems interesting i'll probably pick it up it's just i'm i'm really chill with that question number six what's your favorite video that you've made Ooh, that's a good question i think my june wrap up i think that video is hilarious and it's one that i got really proud because it was one of the videos where i could really pull out all of my editing skills that at the time or still very much beginner level. I don't know, it was the first video where I finished editing and I was like, whoa, I'm so proud of this. And that's really pretty funny. It's pretty hilarious. That 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 whole video is pretty hilarious. I like it a lot. Seven, tag at least four small booktube channels or every small channel you can think of. The thing is, Elise tagged pretty much everybody I can think of. So so I'm gonna think I'm gonna link the people in the description below and I'm also going to tag them on Twitter so they can do that too. But yeah, this was a really, really short video. I swear to God, one day I'll be able to make only short videos, but you know. But yeah, this was a really short video just to answer the tag. I absolutely adore making tags. I never thought I was going to have so much fun with it as I have. So yeah, this was just a quick tag video. I'm gonna link the tag people in the description below. T check out their channel. Also check out Elise. Elise is the cutest human being and she must be protected at all costs. And I'll see you next time. Bye!